All right, all right, all right, all right. It is Wednesday. It is time for Zoom. It's the non-denominational, completely neutral holiday party. Call it what you will. I am so happy you are here. It is Wednesday. It is time. We got so much amazing talent. We got third time here. We got Meadow Perry doing bubble magic. If you've never seen it, you are in for a treat. She's doing it live tonight. And then we got the amazing Etch Man. He's back. He sings. He does Etch a Sketch at the same time. He's got a holiday awesome set. By the way, tonight is family friendly. It's going to be a nice, friendly, fun show. I hope you enjoy it. And no, no politics, no nothing nasty, no comedians. It's just going to be some family fun. It's going to be great. Some magic. We've got some music. It's going to be great. And then we got Jack Sparib. He's his first time here. He's got some funny stuff. He looks great. Wait till you see. And then my buddy Jonathan Molo back again. My bud. I am so happy everybody's here. And, um, oh, yeah, I was going to tell you something. Hmm. Welcome to Zoom Lagoon! so happy you were here i just want to let you know that this is episode 24 which means this will be up soon but we have 23 episodes already on youtube just look up scott blue or zoom lagoon there's my 10 part series happy hour which has rock stars and people touring all over the world we have actors we have uh comedians warm-ups a lot of fun stuff and then my movie pinch is on amazon prime check it out for the holidays and next week oh yeah it's our goodbye 2020 show we're gonna have fire magic and comedy we got first timer daniel greenwolf my buddy paul green double green and then we got the awesome awesome super talented michael rayner and i'll be here if you want to be on a show every week make your own show baby that's how that works out okay anyways we are going to play a game and you're thinking what are we playing for it's the official zoom lagoon gift everybody wants it who is gonna win it elvis sunglasses all right now it's time to meet our gallery and Okay, hey, let's give a round of applause. We have the lovely Meadow Perry. Round of applause, everybody. Meadow Perry, how you doing, sweetheart? Welcome back. Good, thank you. I'm so happy to be back. <laughs> oh, it's awesome. I can't wait to see what you're going to do. Then we got the amazing Etchman is back. How are you doing, hey. the amazing Etchman? I'm great. I'm great. Happy holidays. Happy holidays to you, too. We got first timer, Captain Jack Sparrow. Let's give a round of applause. Mm -hmm. Come on. All right. Oh, yeah. How you doing, Mike? I'm fine. How are you? I'm glad you're here because every time I do any accent, it ends up sounding like a pirate. No matter what. <laughs> that's not a bad thing. That's a perfect thing. That's excellent. See? Yeah, see, I should, don't change the accent, change your company. That's what I'm saying. Okay, anyways, I'm glad you're here, brother. And then we got the returning Jonathan Molo. How you doing, Molo? <laughs> you're muted, my friend. But I'm sure you're saying something awesome. Yes. I was trying to look all um, gangster in my onesie. Look at this. Dude, it's usually not gangster, but you're making it work, bro. 
Oh, thank you. Thank you. It's sexy, right, ladies? Look at this. Dad bod. <laughs> oh, my goodness. Those other shelves on that elf, they ain't got nothing on you, Holmes. Mm, thank you. Thank you. Mm. Uh, uh, well, hey, you know what it's time for? It's time to play Quiz Zoom Lagoon. So here's what happens. I have some categories for you. They're all Christmas-based. We're going to go in order of performance, which will be Meadow Perry, then the Amazing Edgeman, then Jack Sparrow, and then Jonathan Molo. Here are your categories. Christmas Ride, Santa Deer, Christmas Spell It, Christmas Movie, Christmas Carol, Christmas Elvis, Viva La Christmas, or Christmas Song. All right, starting with Miss Meadow Perry. Which category would you like? Or would you like to hear them again? You know, the last two times I did not do so well on Quizoom. So <laughs> I'm going to pick something easy, which I, I think might be easy. And I'm going to go with the, what is it, the reindeer? Santa deer? Santa deer. <laughs> okay, this is a question. I think you can get it. Okay. Santa has his reindeers. Which reindeer of Santa's has the same name as another holiday mascot for a different holiday? I know this one. I know this one. Cupid. Cupid is <laughs> correct. <Yay>! Correct. <laughs> Cupid, of course, from Valentine's. So Meta Perry, two points. By the way, if I give you a question and you don't know, you could say, I'd like a hint, and then you could answer for one. Oh, if someone doesn't get it right, everyone gets a chance to steal. Wait till they guess, and then raise your hand quick. I'll call them the first one. And uh, if there's been no hint, you could get two points. If I've already dropped a hint, you could steal for one point. Okay, That's but good. Meadow is up two points, and now we cut over to the amazing Etchman. All right, let's do this. I Here's will your category. Person left we have christmas, christmas movies. Ride. oh you already got one christmas movies christmas movie what as is you can see on my edge of sketch i'm actually doing four christmas movies right now i have a feeling you're gonna do good on this okay here we go what is the number one grossing christmas movie of all time number one grossing christmas movie of all time Ooh, i would have to say it's a wonderful life Oh, what, what anybody it? else anybody for the steal anybody for the steal a uh, steal steal jonathan molo yes i I'm, I'm hoping i'm guessing it's one of my favorite christmas you could get a hint as well you could go hint for one point or go i got it another. i'm going going full board christmas story the christmas story yes you might shoot your eye out oh the highest money grossing anybody else <laughs> It, it, anybody going once, going twice? It is oh, Home there. Alone. Home oh, Alone. Oh, that makes sense. Is uh, Home Alone? It, it was the number. It, it grossed total international five hundred and twelve million dollars. And interesting fact, that was in nineteen ninety. It held the record for the highest grossing live action comedy movie for twenty one years until Hangover Two in two thousand eleven. Hangover. Wow. Wow. So, hey, that's how Macaulay got all that party money. All right, here we go. <laughs> just wait until the pirate Christmas movie comes out. The pirate Christmas movie will, will win everything. You'll see. I mean, there's going to be one, right? <laughs> right? No. And speaking of the pirate, it is your turn, Jack Sparrow. Here's what is oh, left. We have spare ribs, spare ribs. Spare we don't rib. want to get sued by anybody. Dear God. <laughs> exactly. That's a much more delicious name. Okay. Here we go. We have Christmas Ride, Christmas Spell It, Christmas Carol, Christmas Elvis, Christmas Carol, Christmas Carol. Okay. Yeah, I like her. She's cute. Yeah, it's, it's, that's, that's what like, you're talking about, right? That's that's not what you're talking. Oh God, I'm in trouble. Sounds All right, like the ahead. one your mom went to high school with. Oh, you remember Carol? Okay, here we Christmas go. Christmas Carol. Um, we called her Christmas Carol because she always came over at Christmas. <laughs> right? I know her. Yeah. Okay, go here's ahead. Your Shoot. Question. How many ghosts visit visited Ebenezer Scrooge in a Christmas Carol? Oh, ding, 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 ding. Oh, I have no idea. Three. <laughs> Anybody for the steal? Oh, uh, wait. Oh, uh, you don't say it. You're I want right to steal it. I want to steal Anybody it. Anybody, Meadow Perry for the steal. <laughs> Four. I, 
I was gonna say four, <laughs> but yeah. Four. Uh, I would you gotta it. count the one dude, right? Right. 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 That's That's right. Right. four points. And Jacob Marley. You gotta remember Jacob Marley, the doorknob. Uh, <laughs> right. So Meadow Perry, oh, four points. Oh man. Yeah. There was three of them that took him somewhere, but the first guy kind of set it up. Yeah, right. yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. It's, like, it's like on the menorah, there's the one that lights the other candles. Everyone forgets <laughs> to count it. It's like that. Okay, here we go. Uh, now it's time for Jonathan Molo. Here is your turn. All right, Jonathan Molo, here's what is left. We got Christmas Ride. We have Spell It, Christmas Elvis, Viva Christmas, or Christmas Song. Oh, I love my Christmas songs. Let's do it. Christmas songs, please. Okay, this is a question. The most downloaded, downloaded, which is different than, you know, the old selling the vinyl. What is the number one downloaded Christmas song of all time? Ooh, you can get a hint um, and play for one point, but Meadow's got four, so you better go uh, all in and just go for I, it. I'm going all in. Um, um, I... I Dang it, I don't know the name of the song, but it has to be Mariah Carey. All I want for Christmas is you. That is absolutely <laughs> correct. All right. In fact, that has uh, been downloaded 3,200,000 times. The next closest one is half of that, which is uh, Do You Want to Build a Snowman, which is 1,600,000. So there we go. That is Quizum Lagoon. Our winner is Miss Meadow Perry. Third time to charm, baby. So you got some Elvis sunglasses. They're going to be Amazon right to you. People really do win on Zoom again. <laughs> All right, everybody. I want to tell you guys about something real quick. Okay, I'm going to go back to this. On Zoom Lagoon, our artists are coming on here, and I appreciate their time so much. Oh, I really do. I feel blessed that I have people who come on the show and bring their extraordinary talents. So we got a talented group tonight. So what can I, what did I thought, what can I do? I try to give them the biggest intros you've ever had in your life, ever. I do a whole song about you. And I've done, so far we've done in, uh, other episodes in the style of Queen, the Beatles, the Rolling Stones, Metallica, Halloween, Bob Marley, Elvis, U2, Prince, Pink Floyd, Bowie, Springsteen, Led Zeppelin. Last week we did Danny Elfman. And this week, of course, we're doing Christmas classics. We're doing Christmas classics like ones by Elvis, U2, and more. Here. As Time to do sets. 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 Display. You know, jingle bell time is the right time, my baby, to do your bubbles in a one horse sleigh. Metal Perry, you're a bubble fairy, and I'm glad you're back again, cause you are here, my friend. Cause that's the Metal Perry, that's the bubble fairy, that's the Metal Perry rock. Back on Zoom Lagoon, baby. Wow, that's amazing.
Oh, yeah. Wow. Oh, <laughs> That's the thing. Awesome. particular shape. But I created a game for myself because I wanted to challenge myself to create new things. Scott, I was wondering if you could help me with this. Yes, absolutely. Awesome, awesome. All right, so on each of these cards, I've written down a different shape, an animal or a form that I could create out of bubble foam. Now there's different things on here like sheep, cloud, <laughs> Snake. I promise they get harder. <laughs> Worm. Okay, okay. I, I promise there's different levels of difficulty in here, like flamingo, skyscraper, so on and so forth. Okay, Scott? So you're going to help me pick one of these cards. I'm going to start fanning through them, and you're going to tell me when to stop. Okay, are you okay, ready, Scott? Yes. Okay. All right. Now you tell me when you want me to stop. Right here? Is that yeah. where you want? Yeah. Or do you want to go one further? Right there. Right there's good? Okay. So I'm going to show you the card that's on the bottom in the middle here. Don't tell me what it is, okay? I'm going to close my eyes and I'm going to show you what's on the bottom. Okay? Mm. You got it? Yes. I don't know if I have it the right way. Okay? I got I it. Got it? Okay. All right. Now, I'm going to build that out of bubble foam and I'm going to see if I truly have a connection with bubbles. Ooh, a bubble prediction. This is nice. I like this. <laughs> That's a sweet twist. I can't even do dishes. What the? What? Oh my God. Card. What is this what you were thinking of? It kind of looks like it. A person. It, kinda, it that's totally a person. Yeah, that is Yeah, amazing. that's the weak person. Yeah. Great. Okay, all right, all right. I see your skeptical. And okay, maybe my bubble sculpting skills aren't that great. Amazing. So I've never let's seen get rid of our bubble guy. But it might be more impressive if I made a prediction before the show. Ooh. This envelope has been here since the start of the show. Let's see what's inside. It even says prediction right on the envelope. Even, look, I made it all pretty. It looks like a bubble. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> if it wasn't a prediction, I'd be like, huh, oh, well, okay. Re -re repurposing. I get it. Okay. Whoa, no way. Oh, oh, oh that is awesome. Oh, wow. Yeah, yeah bravo. Awesome. Like that whole ESP thing. <laughs> <laughs> wow. <laughs> Jurassic Park, bro. That is tight. 
wow. What? <laughs> <laughs> that is just great. Oh, what a trip. Oh, man. Oh man, that is crazy. <laughs> oh yeah. <laughs> so original. Once again, my name is Meadow Perry, and I want to thank you so much for having me on the show tonight, Scott. Happy holidays. Oh, my God. Yeah, okay. Amazing. It's almost Christmas. Would you draw me a picture? Just one condition, yo. It's gotta be on Etch-A-Sketch. What? Yeah! He can draw anything And if you heard him sing He can sing any song You're waiting, well it won't be long To see the Etch-Man The amazing Etch-Man Yes, the amazing Edge Man. He's coming up real soon. Merry Christmas and happy holidays from Zoom Lagoon. Welcome back to the amazing Edge Man. Woo! Great. I just did your picture right here. <laughs> Oh, man, so cool. Right where Bruce Willis is. This is all the holiday pictures I'm working on. A special. I'm debuting this today on your show. Oh wow! I wrote a Christmas song and gave you a videotape to play. So uh, that's my original Christmas song that uh, you'll hear on the video as I etch a sketch uh, from your other holiday classic. When the world seems hazy and lazy and dark. There's a day on the calendar I mark And when I need some hope and cheer I just think of that time of year Hurry up Christmas and don't be late We gotta bring all the love for that hate we're starting Christmas early today Coming your way to sleigh ho, ho, ho So deck the halls and trim the trees Ooh. Jingle, jingle bells and twinkle those keys Oh, worry of Christmas We're starting Christmas early today 
this year. Bring some cheer, ginger beer right here. Oh, grandmas and grandpas, mom and dad, let's make this the best cheer we ever had. Brother, wake up and come and see. Santa left us something underneath the Christmas tree. Oh, hurry at Christmas and share what you can. We're all Sing and dance your Baham Blues! Laying on reindeer, got no sack on his back. Came to town on the black pearl, and that's a big black Cadillac. Now, baby, it's Christmas time, pretty baby. The snow is falling on the ground. Yeah, now you be a, a real good reindeer. Jack Spare Rib is back in town. But I have an amazing tri- Shh, quiet. I've got an amazing thing. I'm going to start. All right, I'm going to have to let him out first. I, I've got a trick I want to show you, but before I do that, I've got to get. I, I'm sorry about this. I'd like to apologize in advance. Hello. Oh! And before I say anything, before I do any magic or anything, I want you to know there is no, I don't use any form of any um, trick photography or anything. It's all real magic. See, I've got my Harry Potter magic wand. <laughs> Harry, Harry Potter, Harry, what? Harry. <laughs> Sorry, Harry Potter. R, it has an R because I'm a pirate. Uh, Harry, <laughs> never mind. I have got the wand. Watch this. Eh? Eh? I make myself come back. <laughs> wow, yes. Oh, wait. Okay, no, that's, that's trick wow. photography. I didn't do any trick photography when I do magic. But Okay, I'm coming. Good God. Hang on. Get up here. Come on. No, hey, wait. No, come on, dude. I was not asking. Shh, get up here. We're doing a show. Oh, fine. I was watching Mandalorian. No, get up here. <laughs> I like Star Wars. <laughs> Baby Yoda, dude. Baby Yoda. Get up here. No. I, I'm He's right like, there hey, with you. hey, woo! <laughs> Wow! Hey, that was fun. Let's do it again. I'm holding up a card. Tell me what what color is the card? It's blue. <laughs> Not the back of the card. The front. What color is? I can't see. What do you mean you can't see? You're holding it in front of the screen. Oh, it's a jack of clubs. The, you can't peek a. Where'd your mask go? I got the mask. Here, we're going to use the mask. You said we didn't need a mask. Just, shh. Here, put the mask on. No, don't eat it. I was going to put it over your eyes. Why? So you can't see. Oh, I can't see. <laughs> I know you can't see. That's the point. But I can't see. What are you doing? I can't see. you got to do this when you can't see. Why? Ray Charles did it. Stevie Wonder did it. Would you stop that? That's not nice. Just sit down. Now, I've got a card. Do you? Yes, I do. I can't see it. I know. That's the point. <laughs> okay. Tell me what color it is. Blue. No, I'm not talking about the back. No, everything is blue. I see blue everywhere. <laughs> Would you? That's because you got a mask on. This blue. Stop. Okay. Okay. Now tell us what the card is. Uh. Uh. Go on. It's a red card. Good guess. Okay. And. It's a diamond? Right. It's the Ace of Diamonds. Wow. Okay, okay wait, wait, wait. I think, I think that's because I knew. Somehow it's because I knew so that you knew. So I, okay, I got, wait, wait, wait. We need one I can't, so I can't see. Huh? We'll do something where I can't see what it is. Why? Because then you don't know. Um, you just, you'll do magic instead of just reading my mind. Huh? <laughs> Watch. <laughs> I've got my cup. You see this? We got this at Disneyland. Here, wait a second. We'll go close up. Look, you see that? I got this at Disneyland, and it's a really cool-looking cup. It's got barnacles on it. I can't see. I'm not showing you. 
<laughs> it's got barnacles and stuff, and then I've got dice. And it used to have really cool dice with, like, uh, skulls and stuff on them, but then I think one of my kids lost it. And then... Uh, I think they ate it. No, they did not. Stop it. <laughs> anyway, these are from a different game, and you can see every time they roll, they come up different. So? It, it shows you that they're not, um, what's the word, uh, loaded. The dice aren't loaded. No, the pirate is loaded. He had a lot of rum before the show. <laughs> I did not have rum. Anyway, the dice come up different because I roll them. Huh? The dice. Dice? The dice. Dice, dee dee. Dice, dice. What is this, the 90s? Oh, my God. Listen, just, I've rolled the dice, and now they're underneath the cup. They are? Yes, they, trust me, they're under the cup. And... I can't see them. Then how do you know they're under the cup? Would you get up here so the camera can see you? Where? I can't see the camera. Just hold still. <sighs> Tell us what numbers are on the dice. Huh? I thought you could do magic. Tell us what numbers are on the dice. One, two, three, four, five, six. <laughs> Not all the numbers. The ones that are facing the top. The, the ones up. The, the ones that are on the top of the dice. <laughs> How the heck am I supposed to know that? I thought you could do magic. Oh, yeah. Yeah. Go on. Okay. Go ahead. Two, three. Are you, you're just counting. No, there's a two and a three. No, there's not. <laughs> yes, there is. Okay, fine. What's the last one? Go on, tell us. You can't do this. Yes, I can. I heard that. No, go on, then tell us. <laughs> okay, okay. I see a six. A six. And it's blue. Because of your mask? No, dude, it's a blue dice. All right, fine. Yeah, go ahead. Look, let's see if you can really do that. I want to do my trick. Just, just go ahead. It's a two, a three, and a blue six. See, you were completely, you were completely. I got it totally, dude. Forget it. I don't. You're freaking me. Oh. Blue, blue, blue. <laughs> Whatever. Just get in the box. No. Say goodbye. Hello. No, no. Say goodbye. <laughs> Hello. Say goodbye, Maynard. Goodbye, Maynard. Get in the box. <laughs> no, I don't want to go. I'm putting your mask yeah, in there and the, just say goodbye. No. I'm going to close it. No. Quit it. I can't breathe. What? I can't breathe. I can't hear you. I can't breathe. What do you mean you can't breathe? Your socks are in here. Oh, my God. <laughs> <laughs> all right, all right. Just be quiet. All right. I, I, I want to do one trick. Do I have time to do one trick? Um, it, it's a trick. Uh, here, I got it. Um, Scott, will you help me with a trick? I need Absolutely. a lovely volunteer, a lovely yeah. assistant. And you, you're lovely. Yeah, there we go. Hey. That's perfect. That's excellent. Okay, Scott, um, let's see. Um, I need you to help me with... Uh, are we in gallery mode right now? Can we go to yes. gallery mode? Yes. So that way I can see you and you can see me. i got to put myself... That's the problem. I'm like... Everything's like spotlight. I see myself everywhere. There. Oh, there you guys are. <laughs> I thought you all left. It was just me and the monkey. I'm like, oh, my God, they left us. Anyway, here, I've got a deck of cards. I want to do a card trick with you. All right. Uh, first, I'll, let me shuffle them for you. And, and a cup. And uh, ooh, a one-handed cut. Huh? Huh? All right. Now, now uh, Scott, could you just take those cards from me, please? Okay. And just take the cards and uh, give them a shuffle. Nice. Oh, yes, yes. Oh, he's doing all the shuffles. He's Okay, okay, hang on, hang on. I'm, where's my magic wand? I've got that magic wand. I'm about to turn you into a master magician. I mean, uh, a, a, a cardistry magician. They can do all sorts of fancy things with cards. Watch this. Here we go. Oh, that's it. That's all it took. And now you are the best magician at, at least within a 100-mile radius. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. No, seriously, you can do amazing things. Uh, go ahead, cut the cards with one hand. I bet you can do that now. Of course. Yeah, nice. Okay, but wait. This is, I can't even do this. <laughs> can you shuffle the cards with one hand? Oh, yeah! In oh, midair! Wow. Oh, my God! That's amazing, Scott. See, as I one told does. you. As one does. The, <laughs> You could have bought one of these magic wands at Universal Studios for 80 bucks. I got it at Walmart for 9 bucks. Still works. See that? You're amazing. Now, Scott, here we go. Let's say, um, let's say you're good enough with your cards to be able to separate the red and the black cards. Which do you take out, the red or the black? Uh, the red. 
Okay, so you got the red. Hold the red. That leaves you with uh, diamonds and hearts. Now, uh, let's assume you have a big cannon sitting in front of you. A big cannon, like, like off my pirate ship. But it's invisible. Don't worry. It's right there in front of you. Which are you going to load into the cannon? The uh, hearts or the diamonds? The diamonds. Okay, load the diamonds in the cannon. And I'm going to count backwards from three down to one. And you fire that cannon. We'll blow the diamonds away. Ready? Three, two, one, fire! Ooh, sound effects. <laughs> this is a high-end show. This is definitely a high-end show. I heard that cannon fire. All right, so now the diamonds are blown away. That leaves you holding the hearts, and that leaves you with uh, boom, uh, 13, right? There's a ace, a two, a three, a four, a five, and all those other numbers in between, all the way up to jacking queens and kings and things. All right. Hold them in your hand. You are going to do an amazing thing with these cards. It's going to be incredible. You can do something that I can't really do. I'm practicing. I'm not very good at it. It's called springing the cards or, or a fountain of cards. I, I know Jonathan's looking like, what? He can do that? Yes. He's just that good. That wand did it. Okay, now hang on. Wait. There's more to it, Scott. You are so good. You can do this in slow motion like bullet time in the matrix or something. So hold the cards in your hand and get ready. Oh, in your other hand, I want you to be holding a glass, like a wine glass or something clear that you could, like just hold up your hand like that. You've got to, uh, well, don't drink it all. <laughs> hold up the cards, hold up the glass. You're about to shoot the cards out of the hand into the air. Ready, one, two, three, shoot those cards into the air, slow motion. There they go. Look at them fluttering back down. Now reach out with your glass and catch one of those hearts in the glass. Did you get it? Nice. Nice. I saw that. Tell us which of all those hearts did you catch in the glass? Three. Three? You, you could have picked an ace or like a king or something cool, but you picked it. Fine. I mean, good. <laughs> Excellent. <laughs> Fine. Okay. All right. All right. Was that because it was your favorite card, right? Or... Is this random? It just happened to fall in the glass? It's three. It's a magic three. number. Schoolhouse oh, I got it. Okay. Got it. Okay. All right. Schoolhouse Rock or something. I don't know. I'm yeah, exactly. Not... It's a magic what number. What the heck am I doing on this show? I'm out of here. <laughs> no, Scott, you did an amazing job. Didn't he do incredible? Give him a big round of applause, guys. That was amazing. Yeah, All right, Scott, you can go ahead and uh, spotlight me because I'm going to try to do a trick that matches that one. All right. Now you've made it kind of difficult because let's face it, you you can shuffle the cards with one hand and that sort of thing, and I'm not I'm not that good. But but I do have a deck of cards, and um, they are in the box still. The question is, uh, Scott, should I when I take them out of the box, should I give them a shuffle or leave them like they are? It's up to you. Leave them like they are. So no shuffling. Oh. All right. I mean, I can if you want, but uh, but since you said no, uh, did you want me to cut them? Uh, cut them once. Okay. Do you want me to cut them on the table or in one hand? One hand. <sighs> you really suck. That's okay. Fine. Fine. One hand. But if I drop them, it's your fault. Ah, okay, I got it. See, I'm getting there. I'm almost as good as you. Now, this is this is a whole deck. I mean, it's it's all mixed up. It's a whole entire bloody deck. So it's not just 13 little cards. This is going to be more difficult than what you did, I think. Uh, it's probably not going to work. But I'm going to try to do the same shooty thing. Uh, this is, I'm not very good at this. But I'm going to try to fountain them up like you did into the air. And the problem is, I can't do this in slow motion. I'm not like you. I'm not, you know, special. So... Uh, I'm gonna, they're going to go all over the place. They're going to go really fast. So the whole thing is going to be over like that. And then let, I hope it works. Okay. They're going to shoot up and come all over the place. And oh, right. I've got a glass like you had. I'll try to catch. What was your card again? The three of hearts? Three. Yeah. It's magic. All number. right. Fine. Whoa. Oh. Uh, the three of hearts. Right there. Uh. Not amazing. quite as good as the way you did it, but almost. Anyway, um, thank you for having me on your show, Scott. Back to you. I said, run, run, Molo, because Santa's got to make it to town. 
but get that big bag boy around. Run, run, Molo, cause Santa's gotta make it to town. Alright, play that guitar. Santa's gotta make it to town. Jonathan Molo. Hey, Molo. <laughs> Cleanliness, oh. bro. I look, like it. Look at this smile. It's beautiful, right? Takes work, because bro. Of this. Um, you know, you should warn me, brother. A um, little embarrassed, but uh, uh, ma magic. Ma magic uh, uh, watch. What? <laughs> what? Oh, yeah. <laughs> Whoa. <laughs> what? Oh. What? Hygienic oh, hijinks. Goodness. I like oh, uh, hey, you have to keep up with this beautiful smile. Yes, uh, it's uh, it's your Filipino elf on the shelf, Jonathan Molo. <laughs> I'm back for the third time in a row. I don't know why you keep on having me back. Uh, no clue, but I'm honored, Scott. I dig your vibe, um, man. You're a positive guy, and I love it. Oh no, I I appreciate it, brother. Um, I'm I'm on to you. Uh, so through uh the the Zoom council, I I just made that up. Uh. <laughs> I am supposed to do a, a virtual sobriety test. Yes, a virtual sobriety test. Um, and I, uh, Jack, spare rib. Uh, yeah, I'm looking at you, brother. Mm. Uh, yeah. You want to go <laughs> gallery? Are we going gallery right yeah, now? Yeah, let's go, let's go gallery so I can see all my beautiful friends. <laughs> so there is one way to, uh, before we administer this uh, virtual sobriety test, we we need a we need to have a drink. Absolutely, we need to have a drink. Pick up your drinks. Man. <laughs> Anybody? Yes. Um, but a magical drink. What are you guys doing? Oh, uh, what? If I just shake, there we go. All right. <laughs> um, and uh, cheers. Watch. What? There what? we go. Oh, I think dude. that's enough. <laughs> Excuse me. Um, Cheers! Yes! No way! Oh, it doesn't. That's it. That's all I got. That's all I got. No sobriety test. I forgot. I, I'm forgetting here. So this sobriety test uses one card with four sides. Absolutely, one card with four sides. If you didn't think that was weird, uh, you already failed the test. But I'm going to show you anyway here. So here we go. One card with four sides. This is the first side. This is the second side. This is the third side. And this is the fourth side. Wow. <laughs> mm. Do it again. Thank you, sir. <laughs> have to get in my house. Get out. That's <laughs> good, man. These people, you know what? I'm going to do it because he asked so nicely. Here we go. Once again, this is the first side. This is the second side. This is the third side. And this is the fourth side. Everyone is so amazed you forgot to clap. Yeah, <laughs> oh, oh my goodness. Uh, I'm I was in awe of that. I didn't think about Thank it. Thank you so much. No, no, it's, it's, I feel the love. I feel the love. I think I know what the problem is. We're going to do this till you all like it. Yes, <laughs> we're going to do this till you all like it. Let's go. Here we go. First side, second side. Third side, and of course the the fourth side. Yes. Wow. <laughs> oh my goodness! I could feel the love here tonight. It is Christmas. Um. So raise your hand if you want to know how this works. Raise your hand if you want to know how this works. Let, let's see. Okay. If you didn't raise your hand, you can leave. That is just rude. No. <laughs> I'm gonna show you anyway. The way this works is I actually have five sides yes raise your hand if you called it you're all too smart you're all too smart absolutely see if i cover this blank spot right here some people think there are six sides uh six spots i'm sorry here uh, that 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 wine that's what hit me here if i cover this spot right here some people think there's four 
Same on this side. Gallery, with your hands, with your finger, show me how, how many spots do we have? One. <laughs> One, absolutely. Metal Perry, absolutely. A plus there. But in reality, there is uh, two. Yes, <gasps> absolutely. <laughs> There's two. We're, it's catching metal by surprise. It's all good. Here we go. If I if I cover this black spot right here, some people think there's three. If I cover this spot right here, some people think there's only one. So some people think there's six. Some people think there's three. This is the way you know you need to just just slow it down a bit. Slow it down. Christmas is still two days away. If you see an extra spot uh, 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 oh, on this side, slow it down. <laughs> Slow it down. It doesn't exist. <laughs> Absolutely not. If you see an extra spot on the whole this side, slow it down. <laughs> slow it down. It's not going anywhere. If you see this many spots, you need to quit it. Uh, Just quit. Uh, uh, Put the bottle away. It's not worth it. It's too close to Christmas. Um, thank you very much. Santa is not going to be very happy. How did everybody do? Did everybody do great? Uh, I, I need, another, I need ah. another drink. <laughs> you need another drink. Yeah, that's what that's what we learned from this. We need another to that. <laughs> that is absolutely gross. Uh, but I did bring everybody a gift tonight. Um, okay. I wrapped it myself. Um, it's uh, I'm a dude. We don't wrap gifts. Am I right, fellas? <laughs> we, we are horrible at wrapping gifts. It is Christmas. It is the holidays. I even put a bow on it. Uh, because, you know, I, this show is very special to me. So, uh, uh, you know, when I usually ask this question, it's I usually get socks. People uh, dislike socks. And it's usually the younger crowd. But the older you get, the older I get, I absolutely love socks. Socks right. are, like, awesome. They're comfy. And, uh, yeah, sometimes they can be very stylish. Yes. Here we go. I have some cards here. Uh to actually two packs of cards and they have pictures of socks all right this is the part that usually everybody starts leaving uh, uh your viewers start dropping down because we're we're gonna do a trick with socks uh, right, can i change my here. answer again uh socks oh, is it socks, socks? <laughs> i thought we discussed this we, we'll need to discuss it like here we go uh oh look at those socks they don't match this is the problem they don't match uh, but that's okay. Here he is. It's the thought that counts. Uh, and what else? Ooh, yes. I like the blue one. Anybody like the, the, the what is that? Uh, 3D McDonald's. type of thing. Yeah, that is kind of cool. I like it. It is a McDonald's kind of thing. Here we go. And we're going to keep on looking. Oh, this is kind of like it's a party, but you're, you work for a business. Awesome. Yes, that's cool. And then we have. Oh, uh, that makes me dizzy. And we've seen this one before. There's the other pair. That is cool. And uh, um, metal. Yes. <laughs> Good, great job, by the way. You killed it <laughs> earlier. You. Yes. <laughs> uh, metal, I'm going to have you do me a, a quick favor, a very okay. quick favor. Um, I need you to call out stop anytime you like, quickly. Okay. Stop. Oh, right here. Oh, yeah. We'll place this right over here. You stopped yeah. right over there. I didn't cut it off. And uh, you, you could, all the cards are different. You could have chosen any one of these. You could have stopped at any one of these uh, socks, these many socks. Mm -hmm. Are you guys falling asleep yet? Did, <laughs> did Scott leave? Oh, I'm man. here, baby. I'm cool. here. I'm okay. Okay. I just wanted to make I'm sure. Big I... on sock game. I'm thinking about <laughs> I don't... what she is. I, oh, I'd wear that with this pair. I, 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 I... I don't know what I'm doing with my life. This is a, the worst <laughs> ever trick. Here we go. So you get it. There's there's piles of socks. <laughs> we're getting we're getting and uh, you know surprisingly my kids love this this trick here. Uh, so for the very first time, Meadow, you could have stopped anywhere. Uh huh. But you stopped at two pairs of socks. And what are the odds that they would actually match? You picked a matching pair. I don't know. How many are there? I have to do the math. <laughs> We're going to have to do that later. I should have planned ahead, but I did it. But <laughs> She's oh, this is not literal. bad. A literal. <laughs> this is festive. It looks like you're wearing a banana. Oh, that's cute. That's, that's yeah. cool. Okay. It's All a great right. Christmas. And, I think it's um, not bad. That's not, that's not bad. And then... <laughs> uh, 
Okay, it doesn't match, but this is kind of cool, kind of Christmas. Oh, I like the stars. It's purple. Okay. okay, not all the magic tricks work, everybody. Um, <laughs> wow, what a way to end. Wait a minute. Wait a minute. In this bag, you remember I bought I bought us all oh. a gift. This is all of our gifts, but we'll keep it at my house. We'll keep the gift at my house. Um, That's what your gift is too. It's at my. <laughs> there we go. Oh. What? <laughs> yes. Oh, nice. <laughs> yes. Wow. One for one. Meta. One for one. Absolutely. And, uh, ooh. <laughs> oh. Yeah, that's two for two. Oh, yes. wow. oh my goodness. That is the second shot. And there's nothing else. In the bag. Oh. Uh, give that a round of applause. Give her a round of applause. Yeah. That was so cool. That's that, that it though. That oh. was that it. Because that was luck. <laughs> and this is magic. Hmm. You remember all the cards at one time did not match, but with the snap of the finger, no. we have Stop. matching cards. Stop. They oh, all match. Wow. My mom would be proud. Yes, yes. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow. oh my goodness. Yes, all of them wow. match. Yes, thank you so much, Scott. Happy holidays. Merry Christmas. I love all of you. Wow. Um, and uh, we'll see you soon. Next year. Bye. Wow. Hey, thank you so much. And hey, Mr. Etchman, should we take a look at your yeah, creations? I, actually, I didn't finish Bruce, but I did everybody in the gallery. So, oh, uh, let's take a look at, whoa. Oh, wow. Oh, cool. oh, oh my God. God. <laughs> wow. Absolutely fantastic. That was awesome. I love it. Wow. Oh, my God. Oh, so my cool. God. <laughs> hey. <laughs> Like I was saying earlier, That's insane. if you have a company party, you have a personal party, and you need some talent, come on, Bubbles, Magic. We got Pirates with Monkeys <laughs> cool. and Magic. Awesome. We got Etch-A-Sketch doing drawings of you and of your company or whatever, your favorite movie, the theme of your party. We got so much talent here. Hire us. Come on. Let's 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 rock your next Zoom, everybody. All right. I want to thank all my guests. I want to thank the lovely Meadow Perry. Yay, hey, bubbles are awesome. Amazing action. I want to thank Jonathan Molo. Yeah. Chris Kramer, Captain Jack Sparib. Yes. Oh, I gotta give you more applause. Yes. Captain Jack Sparib. Hey. All right, guys. Hey, and on a serious note, I want to say that all our performers perform for free tonight, but we want you to pay some attention to the American Heart Association at wheart.org. www.heart.org. So easy, so easy. Give if you can, and if not, take care of your own heart, everybody. And uh, on a personal note, uh, my son uh, has come a long way, and he just did his finals, and he got out of four finals, uh, or five finals, because he had two for one, one A and four Bs. Oh, yeah, two yeah. Blue Grind. Yeah. Blue Grind for the win. So Woo. I want to say, uh, Stevie Ray Blue Grind, I love you. I'm so proud of you, buddy. And I want to say, uh, my family, I love you. I think this holiday season is just a, it's a wash and it's a wash for a lot of people. And the fact that uh, if you have loved ones not in the hospital, if that is not your circle, you're doing good. You're doing good. We're going to get past this. Don't take it personal. I know. I, I, I can't say I don't want to see some relatives. I love them. I want to see them. But I'm going to hold off. I'm going to play it safe because um, you got to play the long game, baby. You got to play the long game. And uh, I was going to tell you that next week, it's our say goodbye to 2020. 
Uh, with we got Daniel Greenwolf, we got Paul Green and Michael Rayner, and I'm gonna debut a new song which I haven't written yet. So I just put myself uh. on the spot, and <laughs> but I like a challenge like that. And then all our past episodes are on YouTube or on our Facebook page or Instagram. You can just look up Scott Bluegrind or Zoom Lagoon. Check out Happy Hour, my movie pinch on Amazon Prime. I just want to say, oh, yeah, there was something I wanted to say to you guys. See you next week on Zoom Lagoon, sucker! still here well go have some christmas fun hanukkah fun kwanzaa fun (laughs) i love you we'll see you next week baby take it easy on yourself be safe all right peace out